Good morning. I'm Janelle Varel with your morning digital news brief for this Monday, July 3rd. Happening today, the city of Margate is honoring the big boss with the hot sauce, Jerry Blavitt, on what would have been his 83rd birthday. Margate's mayor, along with other city leaders, will be hosting a plaque dedication ceremony at Margate's Memories in Margate, which is the bar owned by Blavitt that served as a staple down the shore for the last five decades. The bar will also open for one last dance happening at 3 this afternoon, followed by that plaque dedication at 5. Also happening today, one of Philadelphia's major historic landmarks is reopening to the public. Carpenters Hall closed in April of last year for a $3 million renovation, and a fire in December delayed the original reopening plans. A new temporary exhibit will be featuring artifacts that were found during that renovation process. And with no big winners in Saturday night's Powerball, you still have a chance to hit the jackpot. Tonight's drawing now worth an estimated $522 million. That Powerball jackpot has been growing since April. Let's get you caught up on the forecast. Here's meteorologist Kate Ballo. Hot, hot, hot outside today, Kate. Yeah, hot and steamy out there, Janelle. We do have another chance for scattered storms to fire up late this afternoon. Let's take you into that next weather forecast. Your headlines very hot and humid today. A few scattered storms, especially late this evening after about 5 or 6 o'clock. Storms will be isolated but may turn severe, much like what we saw yesterday. Storms were kind of scattered across the region but had a number of tornado warnings yesterday. And we will have the chance for a few more severe thunderstorm warnings, possible tornado warnings with any storm today, even though, again, they are few and far between. So lots of sun, hot and humid for most of the day, and then the chance for afternoon and evening storms. Temperatures around 90 in the city, mid-80s at the shore and the Lehigh Valley. Quick look at the timing. Again, not much going on through mid-afternoon, but then watch what happens after 5 o'clock. A few gusty storms fire up down the shore and inland, and again, could lead to gusty winds and hail potential with any storm that does form. Your next seven days, we've got a few scattered storms for 4th of July as well. We'll likely clear out after the sun goes down. Good news for fireworks to Displays. And then it's dry but still hot with highs in the 90s Wednesday, Thursday, and near 90 Friday. Janelle, send it back to you. All right, thank you, Kate. And remember, you can always get Kate's most up to date forecast and latest stories here on CBSPhiladelphia.com. That's the latest for your morning digital brief. I'm Janelle Burrell. Have a great day.